so I just dropped Willie off at the groomers this morning and I thought I would stop in at my classroom to see what else I could get done. And right as I got here, the groomer said that Willie was ready, so I'm actually on my way out. But I wanna show you guys my room so I have something for the video this week um, because I haven't put up a video in a really long time. But um, I've been in here since Tuesday. It is now Friday and I've gotten a lot done. I still have a little bit more to go, definitely putting up posters and decorating, but I definitely want to show you guys what I have up because I am so in love with my classroom. now. If um, you haven't watched my videos before, I recently moved to second grade, and this is my first time that I'm having a classroom inside our school building. Previously, when I taught fifth grade, I was outside in a trailer. In my very first year, I was inside the building, but I was in our old computer lab. So it was like a center classroom that had exits on both sides, and it really just didn't feel like a true classroom. So I'm really excited for this year to be in a real classroom. I'm, I'm at the front of the building. So if you can see, like that door is my exit door. So. Okay, so let me give you a quick tour. Okay, so that's the Maryland flag because I do teach in Maryland. I'm using it as a curtain right now. I don't know if I'm gonna stick with that. I love my black and white horizontal stripes. The photo frames um, were from Walmart. I think I ordered them through Amazon though. They're the Walmart brand. And those are teaching and so forth um, classroom posters. Love them. Again, another border. I have all this space down here. Isn't that amazing? I didn't have that before. I'm going to take our foundations alphabet down and put up a phonemic awareness um, alphabet that I got off of Teachers Pay Teachers. Um, I also have a kindness alphabet that I want to put up. So more teaching and so forth posters. This stool is from Ikea. I'm very excited because it's exactly my height so I can sit the front of the room a little bit um, but still looking like I'm standing. This is my smart board. I know I was talking about the stool when I wasn't even filming the stool. So I got these plants from Hobby Lobby and Ian told me that I only needed one but I have two windows. I knew I should have gotten two but he convinced me only to get one just to see if I like it and I really do. I love the wired um, um, caddy that it's in in the burlap it's very cute and I want to make this room as homey as I can all of this junk up here it's got to go um, it goes to the smart board it's the technology more teaching and so forth posters um, this is a scientific method that I bought off of teachers pay teachers a while ago I did a wine and design and created that two years ago last year we have to create a safe place in our classroom so I brought my chair in and this so far is my desk this is from Target and this wake pray slay love it it's from Marshall's and then I bought three of the black and white horizontal stripe caddies from Target. I have two carts. This one's from Michael's, the black one's from Ikea. And I actually only meant to buy one, um, but I forgot that I had the other one. More posters, and then all these cabinets are full um, with manipulatives and teacher materials. And then all the junk in the center here is what I have left to do. So it's mainly like posters that I have to put up on the wall. And then like my home high school and then college and like classroom rules. And I wanted to get some laminating done, so I did bring my laminator today but I have a sink in my classroom this year with a water fountain and I got to get this actually cleaned up um, because I'm going to put my mini fridge back here I love that I have a sink um, and then in this section here is going to be our classroom computers so you guys saw the classroom computers up there they're not going to stay there they're going to go back here on a table against this wall and then the kidney table is not going to stay here either it's actually going to be on that side of the room so if I didn't give you a headache on this roller coaster Yay, me, <laughs> and yay you, <laughs> pat yourselves on the back. Um, but I am actually going to go pick up Willie because again, like I said, he's ready to go and I thought I was gonna stay here and get things done, but it looks like I'm not. So since it's Friday, I'm gonna just stay home and enjoy my weekend. I thought I was gonna come here and get things done and then like take Willie home and come back. And you know what? I think I can just get all this stuff done on Monday. Like I really need to not stress about it. A lot of the things I have printed is complete and I just need to laminate it. and. You know what, it's the last weekend before school, so I'm gonna go enjoy myself. Um, you guys saw how much stuff that I had when I packed the car up. My dad actually had to bring six more bins, and I didn't film that, so everything in this classroom is everything that I've accumulated over the last five years of my teaching, and I'm so excited that I'm able to have the cabinet space to be able to store it in. I didn't have that before, and I'm just really looking forward to this year. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more videos of me in my classroom, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!